welcome to online class today we are going to discuss class 4 my world of computer now we are in chapter 5 so today we are discussing internet terminology there are some terms which are commonly used when we are you are using the internet let us learn about these terms so now terms are there we learn that is www that means world wide web so www is a digital space or a big repository of information and resources in the form of a big database it is a way to acquire the information what is stored in a big database it is also known as wave or wave 3 okay w3 we can say this database can store text pictures audio audios videos graphics animations and much more so here this is world wide web this is a database storing okay here informations are stored here okay we can find that is stacks pictures audios videos graphics anime animations these things we can find here so it is a world wide wave everything we can get here then now let us see website okay a website is a pile of web pages just like a book having various pages in it all the data and information stored on the on the internet can be available through the websites to get the information you can open a website and access the information stored on it web pages what is that website this is a like web page okay how the book we are having the pages like that this website is it is having that means website means that site we have to open in net so when we open in that site we will get the informations okay now let us we we'll discuss web page a web page is just like a page of a book which stores lot of information in it this information may be in the in the form of text audios videos pictures graphics tables or hyperlinks etc a web page is a web document which is a part of the website a website may contain several web pages which are linked to each other through hyperlinks so web page this is a, like a page of a book okay how the in book we have pages many pages like that in web page also also we are having the pages and there it is stored what is stored their informations are stored okay so we can search the information or we can find out the information in web pages okay that is we can say we can get or we can get the information that is taxes 
then audios videos pictures graphics tables hyperlinks these things we can get in web page now home page when you open a website in a web browser the first page of the website that is open in front of you is called the home page it is like a doorway from where you can access all the web pages of a particular website so this is like our house we are having like door so we can go outside and we can come okay we can go inside or we can come outside so this way in home pages also we can search inside what is there okay first we have to open the website then in website we have browser is there in that browser first page okay first page of the website that is called the home page then url that is url that is uni uniform research locator okay is the address of a website so here the url it will give us address okay to open a website you must know its url which is to be entered into the address bar of a web browser like here address type so when we write any things or any any title so you have to open url that means address you have to write then ip ad, ip address when a computer is connected to an internet it is assigned a unique address called ip address or internet protocol address it is a unique numeric value which helps to locate a particular machine from the massive network of networks an ip address is in the form of www dot or www or xx it is there in our book xxx dot and xx dot and xsx dot like that it is there where the value of xsx ranges from 0 to 255 so here this xxx that dot that means it represents from 0 to 255 that numer numerical numbers okay for example you see to 124 dot 100 dot 80 dot 64 like that we can see the example so next class we will be discussing net suffering so thank you for watching this video